People often want to know how wire rope is constructed and how it is measured. In this video, I will give you an insight into how wire rope is constructed and how it is effectively measured. As illustrated, wire rope is made up of a core, strand, strand core, and the wire itself. A strand is formed by winding individual small wires in a spiral. Strands are wound around a central core, which could be a fiber or another steel wire strand. The cable is not perfectly round and is made up of several strands of wire. Let's use the 7 by 19 cable as an example. A 7 by 19 cable has six outer strands surrounding a core strand, which counts as the seventh strand. There are 19 individual wires in each strand. The V-shaped area between the strands can be seen if you look closely. The number and size of wires for each strand, as well as the size and number of strands in the rope, have a significant impact on the rope's attributes. Generally speaking, a large number of small size wires and strands create a flexible rope with good flexing and fatigue resistance. Tensile loading, abrasive wear, Crushing, corrosion, and rotation are all affected by rope construction. When it comes to measuring the size of wire rope, the diameter of a rope is used to identify its size. The illustration indicates that for an accurate measurement, the proper diameter of a wire rope is the diameter of a circumscribed circle that will enclose all strands. For an accurate measurement, you must measure the largest cross-sectional measurement as shown here. This is usually done carefully with calipers. Find out more at keeblestrading.com.au